So last week I released a video letting you guys know that Amazon had opted to move away from Android on their Fire TV devices. This will essentially shake up the, the streaming market in my opinion because this will block your ability to install any third party applications on Amazon devices. Now the move is set to happen sometime this year and what we're gonna see is new Fire TV sticks shipping with a new Amazon operating system and also old Fire TV devices, which includes your Fire Stick, your Fire TV devices, will update, thus moving away from Android completely and going towards a proprietary Amazon operating system. Now, the big deal about this is that this will stop your ability to install third-party applications, thus putting the Fire TV devices on par with the likes of Roku and Apple TV. So after I released that video, questions started coming up, asking me what are the best alternatives to your Fi TV stick. Well, today's video, what I want to do is go over the four devices that can easily replace your Fi TV stick. These are going to all allow you to install third party applications and they're reasonably priced. Watch the entire video. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, smash the notification bell. Let's go. Now, before we jump into it, three disclaimers. The first one is that for this video, I have excluded the cheap Chinese TV boxes. Yes, those work, but over my years of doing this, guys, I've bought hundreds of devices. Some of those cheap Chinese boxes are not consistent with their updates. Hardware support for these devices are non-existent for the most part. And also some of them lack features like uh, official Netflix, official apps. Just having said that, I, I couldn't recommend or put those on this list. Second thing we're gonna address is the Nvidia Shield TV. Now the Nvidia Shield TV can replace the Amazon Fire TV stick, but in my opinion, this is in a different category altogether. Pricing is going to be a lot more on Nvidia Shield TV, but if you have the cash flow and you want to just get a device that you know is going to withstand the test of time, Nvidia Shield is a good option. Third thing that I wanted to mention is that I've also excluded Apple TVs and Roku's as alternatives for the Fire TV stick. And the main reason is because these are locked down. These are not going to allow you to install third party applications. So essentially what you're going from the Fire TV stick or the new updates on the Fire TV stick is exactly what you're gonna run into with Roku or Apple TV. Not to take anything away from those, but those are great devices, but they lack that feature that we're looking for. Now, having said all that, let's work our way from number four all the way to number one, with one being the best alternative in my opinion. Now, number four is going to be the TiVo Stream 4K. Now, this is a couple years old, and I don't know if TiVo has any plan on renewing this device, but it's still a great device here in 2024. So the TiVo Stream 4K, of course, is going to have 4K UHD, Dolby Vision, HDR, Dolby Atmos, and it's powered by Android TV. So this is going to have a similar operating system to what you see on the NVIDIA Shield TV, with the exception that it does have some customization as far as your preferred applications. Applications, that's going to give you more content. Um, TiVo Stream does have a lot of features. I do love the remote the setup. This is a perfect size remote in my opinion. Also, the device itself comes with multiple USB ports that you can always update your storage. And of course, this does allow you to install third-party applications. Now, pricing been going up and down on TiVo Stream 4K. Currently, it's at $39, but I've seen it as low as $25. So if you're in the market, this is a good one to look out for. A device number three is gonna be the Chromecast with Google TV. Now, Chromecast has been around for a while. They do have two versions. They do have a 1080p and a 4K version, but the 4K being a little bit older, but these are really Really marked down to put them right on par with the Amazon Fire TV sticks. Now, the HD version is newer. This one is running $19, and the 4K version, which is a little bit older, is $37. Now, just to go over some of the main features, this is an official Google device, does give you 4K HDR. This does have Google TV, which is a polished up version of Android. So, so this is always receiving regular updates. So this will have all the streaming apps that you need. And in addition, this is gonna allow you to install your third party applications. As far as the specifications, we're gonna have two gigs of RAM, four gigs of internal storage. We're gonna have a four core ARM Cortex A55, and this maxes out at 1908 megahertz. So the only reason why this isn't higher is because I feel like this is outdated, it is a couple years old, and I'm waiting for Google to release a newer 4K 
Google TV. Device number two is gonna be the Xiaomi Mi Box S. Now this is a 4K HDR Android TV device. So essentially this is gonna have the same user interface as Nvidia Shield TV, and it does have the Google Assistant built in. Price on this is currently $64. And the reason why I included this is because I've had a couple Mi boxes over the past couple of years, is including this one. And over the past couple of years, this has been a rock star. No issues, receive regular updates. These are solid streaming devices, certified Google devices. And of course, they allow you the ability to install your third party applications. The remote is really well put together, easy to use. Mi Box has a really sleek design and this does have a USB port, which the Fi TV lacks. Video support for this is gonna be 4K at 60 frames per second. This does support Dolby Audio, DTS, supports Dolby Vision, also HDR10, and does have multiple languages. Now this is gonna have two gigs of RAM, eight gigs of internal storage, ARM Mali G31 graphics card, quad core Cortex A55 processor. So solid streaming device, couldn't go wrong picking this one up. And my number one recommendation to replace the Amazon Fire TV stick is the Walmart on 4K streaming box with Google TV. Now, Google TV interface is gonna be identical to what we see on the Chromecast with Google TV. This, in my opinion, is the best competitor with the Fire TV stick. And one of the reasons for that is priced currently at $19. As far as the specification, this does have 4K UHD resolution, two gigs of RAM, eight gigs of storage. CPU is gonna be a quad core Cortex A35. GPU is gonna be Mali G31 MP2. And this also is gonna support Dolby Audio. Now I did review this uh, box as well. And I'll go ahead and link that video below. That way you can go ahead and check out the full review. Really impressed with this box and it's priced right there with the Fire TV stick. So let me know your thoughts. What would you insert in there? What would you take out? Do you agree with my assessment to exclude the Chinese boxes, the Nvidia Shield TV, as well as Apple and Roku from this list? Also check the description where I'll link all these products where you can go ahead and check them out. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, smash the notification bell. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.